Hey everybody, this is Antoine Thomas with the Silver Line Real Estate Group, and I wanted to make a video for everybody and talk about the biggest challenge that the market is facing right now. So uh, we are right now in a very low inventory market, and with the COVID-19 situation going on, it really has made a shift in the market. So we're seeing, you know, homes still selling, but we've seen a lot of buyers that had to leave the market, okay? Listen, so let's dive into that. Buyers were having to leave the market due to losing jobs, losing income, being laid off, right? And lenders don't want to, you know, help a buyer purchase a property if there's an opportunity where they can't pay for, you know, the first couple months rent because they don't have a, have any income. So um, a lot of buyers had to leave the market. Now, at the same time, as far as inventory, you had a big drop in inventory, about 20% over the past 60 days, okay? So, and, and the new listings being activated. So as homes are selling, there's not enough homes replacing those homes that are selling. And there has been a 20% decrease. So we're in a situation now where there's a big uh, problem with not enough homes. And that was a problem that we've been having for a while, but now it's even, uh, it's, it's magnified now because you're in a situation where inventory just continues to drop, all right? So you have, you know, buyers that, are taking a lot longer to find the right home because, you know, when a home hits the market, it's selling quickly because, you know, there's three offers on it and it's selling. So now buyers are taking longer to to um, to find the right home because they got to look at more homes, offer on more homes to be able to lock one down. But the biggest the biggest challenge that we're seeing right now is that there's been some le some great loan programs out there that now have been shelved that is really affecting the flexibility that a buyer has to purchase a property, all right? And there's been some people now with the minimum credit score requirements and the changes in the DTI ratios and stuff like that, where a lot of buyers are just kind of on the sidelines waiting, okay? So that is a challenge, all right? Not only for a buyer, but for a seller, because the seller obviously wants to have more buyers offering on the property, and the buyer wants to have more homes to choose from, all right? So we're kind of in a situation where we're just trying to figure out what is, what's going to happen next? Are there going to be more loan products hitting, coming back for buyers to utilize? Is, it, is the inventory going to increase, right? Because again, keep in mind, we're in 2020. For the past few years, it's been a very hot seller's market. So any more drops in inventory is, is, is going to be very tough, okay? So we're, we're trying to figure out and hoping, is it going to be more inventory? And buyers are hoping, you know, when are we going to have these loan programs back that will allow us to be flexible and be able to make, you know, have an a great opportunity to purchase the property that we want? I just wanted to make that quick video. Hope it does kind of give you guys some insight on what I'm seeing and what, you know, our team is seeing. If you have any other questions, reach out to us. We're always here to help you. Much love and respect. And you guys stay safe out there.